Hi guys, how are you doing? Senior Gaming here and in today's episode I'm bringing you Idle Mafia and I've got for you Patch Note 6.2. So if you Idle Mafia player or perhaps Idle Gamer then make sure you subscribe to the channel as I post as often as possible and bring you best tips and advice. And if you enjoy what you see then hit that like button as well. Alright then guys, so the brand new patch is upon us, you can go ahead and download it straight away and as always some of the changes will apply automatically and some of them you'll have to wait a certain date and obviously I'm gonna mention that in this video. So we're gonna run through a additions, adjustments and optimizations. So the first and definitely a great addition is gonna be a brand new gun kingpin and it's called Abominable Santa and I got to say that's pretty ugly Santa and this one's gonna be available from a 1st of December. So as mentioned just a second ago you download a patch straight away but this one will only appear in a game on the 1st of December. Let's collect this turkey very very quickly and crack on with further additions. So the next one we've got is a personalized enemy tombstone as well as profile. And currently if you're gonna head over to your profile itself and then click on modify, what you're gonna see obviously it's your avatar's frame and chat borders and now you've got a tombstone and backgrounds. So currently you will be able to actually perhaps unlock, there is a chance to do it, where you're gonna have a dead snowman tombstone. And also when it comes to background you'll be able to have this Christmas background. Bear in mind background becomes available on the 14th December whilst tombstone on the first one. And I think because of these two brand new tabs, you'll be able then to personalize your own. And this is just an example how this might look like. Okay. And when it comes to a final addition, we're talking here about a skin that can be now purchased with diamonds. And this is Ava Mermaid Sato. So obviously this is a brand new skin that will be available in the patch notes. Okay, so let's just collect this helicopter this time. So now we're gonna run through all adjustments. So the first one, and I think definitely I'm grateful for this one, is a daily reset. And basically what it means that the game will be adjusted to your time zone. And I definitely enjoy this. A lot of events start around midnight in a London, uh, UK time. And I got to say, you know, when I wake up seven, eight o'clock in the morning, I'm already that many hours behind to other players, which could launch this event much, much earlier. And then we've got some extra adjustment when it comes to stash. So as you see, uh, nations and trades shards can be now directly exchanged to legendary capo shards. We've got some adjustment when it comes to unfinished business, as well as weekend event capos resort. And then finally, when it comes to adjustments, you're gonna have a extra rarity displayed when it comes to gear. We've got another turkey here, and so that's further freebies collected and now when it comes finally to optimizations so basically the first one is going to be a capo awakening so this is going to be related to a mythical capo so if i'm going to head over to let's say a miguel i don't have any mythical capos awakened yet i'm still in the progress of just upgrading them but basically when it comes to the middle one this um, extra awakening ability is pretty much focused around pvp or just overall a um, fight rather than a business and obviously the optimization itself will now look into adding something towards business as well then when it comes to a next next one obviously it's gonna be a stash itself and we're gonna have some improved a gear filter which is great at the moment there is a tons and tons of the gear you got to go through and just carefully select not to sell any of the premium gear. Next one is a jailbreak where slot machine will now affect double rewards for skip stages. Yet again I highly recommend do not use that skip um, option and go with them manually. I have put a separate video about it. This is where you always get more rewards by just doing and playing jailbreak manually. Then number four is unfinished business um, and there is a talent set switcher added. And then finally, when it comes to unfinished business, we're also gonna have optimized mission reward claim process. So that will be it guys. Obviously some of the changes are affecting game immediately. Some of them as mentioned, you will have mainly on the 1st of December and actually background will come on the 14th. But I'm looking forward for, for but I'm looking forward to all these changes so we can obviously enjoy the game even further. That will be it guys, thank you very much for watching and as always, I'll see you next time.